Shegun Shewumi, a former spokesperson to Alaji Atiku Abubakar, says the All Progressive Congress, APC, has nothing to campaign for the next election in the state. He stated this during an interview while supporting the organized labor decision by embarking on an indefinite strike over the state government's negligence of the union demands. Labor is not unreasonable. I'm sure if they had been seen commercially draw down or an attempt to pay whatever is the backlog in a manner that is agreeable to them, I'm sure they are also aware of the finances of the state and that they can, they can shift ground. But when government behaves as though it can do whatever it wants, however it wants, whenever it wants, and the labor force can do whatever, can, can just hold the short end of the stick. You have to say that that government is insensitive to the plight of the workers. And if labor is now about, you know, up in arms against them, if the courts start killing people every day without any serious consequences, even uh, if the whole space is the way it is, if the governor is an absentee landlord, if he has uh, found out the duties of governors to a small cabal around him, if nobody in the state can boastfully say, I can reach him, I can pass information to him. If he's unwilling to touch the people and get you know, real with them. If his governor's philosophy is unclear. If what he, is, he says he's doing is as pedestrian as this, then I don't know what they're going to be campaigning on. A lot of people can be wrong. It's not all the time that big names jumping onto their platform will be right. And don't forget, there is always that uh, tendency for people to just assume that the mass of the people are not taking notice of what is going on. I hold the view that the 2023 election will produce a lot of shockers because I think somehow the consciousness of the people have been woken by many things. And the people have to ask themselves, like I say all the time, the question before the Nigerian people is, has your life been better. Meanwhile, he advised electorates to vote wisely comes 2023.